My playing career was at Rotherham United, nearly all of it. I had a, a brief spell at Burton Albion um, at the end of my sort of full-time career. Um, managed to become their leading appearance maker, um, which is something that I'm, I'm very proud of. It's nice to have that, and I, it'll obviously take some beating, I think, in modern day. I was a bit of a sort of throwback, I guess, in terms of staying at one club for so long. I don't know if that's because I were, weren't good enough to get elsewhere or not. <laughs> Once I left Rotherham, went to Wilkeston Town. There as a player initially, myself and Rob. Um, uh, but David Oldsworth was a the manager then. He moved on at the time to Mansfield and we were asked to take temporary charge. Uh, and that was the start of our managerial career. We were a couple of months off being here uh, a year. So it's uh, you know, been a, a learning curve for us to go into the full time. But one we're confident that we can you know, have success in. That's starting to show on the pitch now what we uh, feel we can achieve uh, and getting the players in that we want. In terms of sort of the coaching, I've got me level two and level three. And actually tomorrow we're off up to Newcastle to take part in the prep course for the air licence. So, you know, we feel it's important to develop um, as managers and as people. And also, you know, I've been involved in roles previous where I've been in charge of coaches uh, that we've, you know, put through their... Uh, level one and level two, uh, in particular, qualifications to go out into schools uh, and coach, you know, young young people. Also helps, um, you know, those coaches perhaps start their careers out, whether it be managing or just coaching at different levels of the game. Uh, so it is important. I know the FA are trying to get more and more people involved in that, um, you know, and that includes, um, you know, women as well that we've seen coming through. You know, we had some young women. Um, that went out to the schools and were very good. I, I, different than a lot of, I think, ex-players, that I chose to go on a public course. Um, and while I think the, the people that, um, you know, the tutors felt it was really beneficial for them to have someone like myself on there, I think it was also nice to be able to uh, give some of my knowledge to the others, although I hadn't achieved that qualification as yet. Um, but also just see how other people work, who are, you know, are really trying to... Um, benefit their clubs whether it be a Sunday league club you know, you know under eights under nines and tens so it's nice to see people out there that are willing to give up their time and, and try and be the best that they can to help you know young people at the at this moment in time we've got you know a half a season left just under in terms of the league we'd want to try and finish as high as possible you know the ultimate aim would be to get in the playoffs the trophy's the same you know and if we could get to you know, trips to Wembley, then, you know, that would be a fantastic end to the season for us. Um, it's a lot of hard work to be done between now and then. You know, on, in the league, we're a bit off the pace, uh, but moving in the right direction. We took the job to try and get back in the Football League. It was the first full-time job that we've got, and we felt we put a lot of hard work in uh, as two previous clubs to get this chance. We don't want it to be wasted, and we don't feel that we've now achieved um, what we what we want to do. You know, that's no disrespect to where we are or anything, but we want to push on again. Hopefully it's with this football club, though. Uh, that would be the ideal scenario for everyone. But, yeah, you've got, I think you've got to have dreams and goals, uh, and it is to manage as high as possible. And realistically, you know, that's the Premiership, and that seems a million miles away at the minute. But everyone has to start somewhere. Um, and so that, that would be the ultimate goal for us.